back for another day, day the 13th episode of the Hardcore Museum. Um, we have a scale, uh, creeper here, but no um, no skeleton with which to shoot him, so we'll just keep running right past. Uh, that was an exciting night. Uh, if you didn't watch my last episode, I am basically out looking for red sandstone and ocean monuments, but um, uh, trying to get a creeper disc along the way. <laughs> and uh, maybe this evening I will set up a little more controlled um, Minecraft evening, that is. A little bit more controlled way of attacking that problem. Because we basically had fre <laughs> Look at that picture. Uh, fresh armor going into last night. And um, uh, uh, you can see I basically wore down half a helmet in one evening um, just getting myself murderized. Um, Uh, we're down to two arrows. Um, I really had a lot, but uh, two arrows and um, much less armor than I would be more com than I'm comfortable with. Okay, so I am looking for biomes which might have red sand or red sandstone. So. Excuse me. <laughs> oh. <clears throat> um, so we're just going to keep traveling, I guess, like this until we do. Um, we also need to find an ocean monument. Um, oh, we found a village, which is cool, but um, completely useless to us in this challenge because we're not allowed to raid from village chests, and we're not allowed to get the carrot that we need. We got one potato from a zombie. Um, <laughs> from villagers. So um, we might mark this out, but uh, um, we are not going to get, get anything useful from here, um, considering every block we need anyway is, um, other than the carrot, is uh, something we need to get from an ocean monument or um, base is red sandstone. So. But look at all that stuff we can't get. Oh man, what a chest! One, two, three, four, five, six pieces of obsidian. Oh, I love those chests and fresh armor and apples. And we can't touch it. Oh, painful. Um, what we will do, in fact, so nobody touches it. We'll lock it up till next time. Um, put down torches just to mark off that we've been here. Hi, buddy. Like lighting up my villages, the crops, so that they grow whenever I'm in the area. Oops. I don't know, just a habit. It also creates a nice glow for the village in general. Hey there, buddy. This has no thing inside. These houses are dark inside too. Look at that. Just do the floor for now. All right, I'm not going to completely light up this village because, let's be real, uh, this is not really part of our objective right now. <laughs> I do want to come check out the church. I always like stealing these three torches back. Thank you. And putting them upstairs. Um, actually, instead of putting it there, we'll put it on each of these corners. Okay. So, yeah, we have... Uh, Ladders were the death of me and my first attempt at this challenge. We are on attempt number two, thanks to that. Um, don't really see anything from the top of the church. So let's get back out adventuring. Um, let's not waste too much time here. And uh, let's get out there. We do have enough to basically... Uh, fix our armor. Um, enough iron if needed. I didn't bring the anvil with me, which was probably foolish, but uh, can always do a quick little caving to grab some extra iron if we need it on this adventure. 
I'm getting really, uh, no, I'm not far from spawn at all. <laughs> I really wound, we really wound back on ourselves. And in fact, oops, I'm going the wrong way. Uh, north is that way. No, I was going south. I won't, yeah. Okay. We're going towards the positive, towards the, yeah, towards the positive Z coordinate, which is not the right way. We wanted to go north. But this is new, yes, yeah, so this is actually back towards spawn. Um, that right spawn is right over there. Uh, we came from over there, but we will we'll head back in that direction. So this is very close. A um, couple hundred blocks. So spawn is 300, positive 300, positive 500. My belief, uh, boom, chicken, go down. This is going to be our, one of our missions while we're out adventuring. Um, I better keep that up because I don't want to get uh, waste too much time. Going the wrong direction. And waste too much food. Grab some saturation here. Okay. Yeah, so chickens we will uh, murder because uh, we want to make arrows at some point. Um, it can be useful in our fights against. Don't press that button, press that button. Just see if this is a uh, practice. Hopping in, hopping out. Nice, so the sword gets it in one shot. Okay. Good to know. And I apologize for the shield being up in the corner, but last night I got to nighttime and I had forgotten to put the shield up. I wonder if this is the river we have been traveling along. Before. I think it is. I think this is... Yes, this is that nice big area that we came into last time we went off in that direction. So this time we're going to go off in this direction, which is good. I did want to come back and go basically go over these extreme hills down here because I don't want to get too, too far from spawn. We're trying to make circles and adventure. Um, but, I mean, if I find the biome of Ocean Monument 3,000 blocks away, that will stink because I have to go back and... I didn't bring everything with me that I need, although maybe I would just uh, gear up there rather than make the journey. We'll have to see. Okay. <clears throat> Ocean Monument Assault is something uh, I learned quite a bit about during uh, Michael Deering's MHC. Um, we had to assault an ocean monument um, with in very little time. We basically had what, nine days or something, and uh, thanks to some great teaching from Hawk Miner uh, and others, we were, I was able to get that done and actually conquer the monument, including killing all the guardians. Um, learned a ton about how to use doors effectively underwater. Uh, both to help us breathe, but also to block the shots of the of the guardians that are in the ocean monument. Uh, we'll head off in this direction. It's about to be night. Kind of don't mind a quiet night in the boat exploring tonight. Hopefully, uh, this extreme hills turns into a mesa where we can find red sandstone or red sand at least. Red sand is all we need. That and an ocean monument. Um, and then we'll get to the the last two things which aren't blocks, carrots and music disc, uh, which are more about mob fighting. So we can do some things to set up traps and things that could make that safer. I see these little things in the water like that right there uh, that make me think 
oh, that might be an ocean monument. And it doesn't render in. It's like frustrating. <laughs> So we're in the ocean, deep ocean is that way, we'd have to basically see Ocean Monument on our left. We're in the deep ocean now, that's good. I do want to stay within sight of shore because we are looking for that red sandstone too. <laughs> okay, there's Taiga over there. <clears throat> and I think after this episode I might do a little research on the wiki. Um, to about terrain generation. I really haven't done it yet. Um, refresh my memory. I've probably done it once or twice in the past. It didn't stick. Um, just to see what biomes, you know, mesas are dry, so um, I know they show up next to deserts and places, but I'm pretty sure I know, like, even birch forests or. <laughs> Uh, sometimes turn into them or um, or forests. Uh, so oh, look at that. See, oh, and if I if I right click him or something, I can think I can get those guys to come in the boat with me even now. Or, or that was saw. Okay, not in the boat with me now. All right, cool looking boat. Um, <coughs> so this looks like it goes in and. Well, well, we won't go that way. That looks like it goes into a river. Um, whoa, that's cool over there. Maybe there's some mountain hasn't rendered in behind it. No, it kind of looks like that's the way it is. Neat. Deep ocean, no ocean monument yet. surface lava on that little island there. I know in 1.8 I've, I've spent at sometimes an hour, up to an hour or so uh, searching for one of these uh, ocean monuments so they are not easy to find and the most frustrating thing perhaps of all is in my first attempt at this challenge I spawned on a tiny little island so I had to get off and immediately uh, made a boat and just was rowing to the next island and found an ocean monument right there. So I was like, oh, this is a great seed. I'll have my spawn point, be able to get all the blocks and uh, have the ocean monument. But then I died in episode two. Uh, so this is the take two challenge. Oh, have to silence that. Sorry about that. almost to the end of day 12 here, so I want to go ahead and complete this episode before I get back to work. Oh, uh, there's definitely a cave under there with some lava. How about we are still in the deep ocean? How about finding that ocean monument? We are getting pretty far away. Got my render distance set. It's 16 chunks. Renders in pretty good. Um, definitely much better in boats than uh, in 1.8. Uh, the both, just the operations, but also the fact that the way the uh, the terrain renders in, um, not so jumpy. Uh, back in ocean, so we won't see. We won't see an ocean monument under us here. Oh, nope, deep ocean again. And seeing land on both sides. We might be coming to the end of the ocean in this direction, which isn't terrible because we're really far. Well, yeah, we're about 2,000 blocks out in the X direction from spawn. It's positive 300.
much of which was boat travel, so it makes it a little easier to get here, but... Huh. No red sand. No ocean monument. Well, for better or worse, I'm proving to you too <laughs> that uh, I didn't do a good job choosing the seed. Um, <laughs> uh, I, I didn't, I didn't, uh, I used, this is, um, Troy Boy 77 is the seed, if anybody ever wants to check out this world, if you see things that interest you. Um, an homage to the, uh, creator of the, of the challenge. <clears throat> hmm. We are covering a ton of ground. We are in a ton of deep ocean, but no ocean monument still. I'd start getting suspicious about 1.9, but as I told you a moment ago, I had that experience of this challenge, finding the ocean monument right away. No red sandstone, no ocean monument. We're not in large biomes, so the biomes do turn over rather frequently here. <laughs> Got some forest, and it looks like plains, and I think that's the beach biome uh, when that is there. Keep going back and forth between ocean and deep ocean that we're in. Oh boy. Don't know what to do about this. Let's see. I think we do need to start turning around a little bit because I'm not going to go. I guess I'd never really see a mesa from the ocean. I don't know about that. That's true. I might have to go over through one of the biomes that. Um, would be next to it to get to a mesa. My guess would be that mesas don't come next to oceans, or at least very rarely. Uh, I guess. But the other thing I need is a melon, and that it comes from a jungle, which would definitely be in the ocean. I just remembered I needed a melon also. Um, so... place to be, searching for that. Mostly looking for an ocean monument. My forward arrow key, W, is getting tired. Uh, rowing all night here. A lot of sand, a big beach here. Okay, we're basically headed back in the other direction now. So we're starting to go in towards the positive X's again. Haven't been in this direction yet. I made sure basically it was going the opposite way. Charge Creeper! Let's go get a Charge Creeper head. <laughs> a horse in the middle of the ocean. Sorry, buddy. Oh, you know what that is? That's a skeleton horse. I haven't seen one of these in one of my worlds before. Cool, look at that. Two sk Whoa! Whoa, whoa, look at that! I could die here! Oh my goodness! Oh, wow, I'd never... <laughs> well... I had never seen that before. Look at that. Um, wow, that was cool. Uh, the, the horses and they multiplied and oh my goodness. Oh wow, that was cool. So cool. Wish I had a saddle. Um, not gonna stick around. Uh, I think it was, I watched a video with Etho fooling around with those things. 
they are neat, but, and they, uh, some of the loot you can get from the skeletons is cool. They got nice helmets. Uh, mine's, mine's pretty good right now. Protection two. It's also half broke. Thanks to fighting all those skeletons the night before. My goodness, we are going the wrong way. Um, we're going far, far away from spawn. And not finding anything. Now the question would be, is behind there... Got another swamp. Don't know, but the day has turned over, I believe. Um, so I'm going to call this an episode here. And uh, we will head, head back tomorrow. Uh, not so exciting. Sorry about that today, but the skeleton horses were awesome. Um, thanks for watching, and uh, if you're doing this challenge along with us, uh, Troy Boy, myself, Felonius, Granny Got Game. Um, oh, 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 there we go. Is that it? Let's just end the episode here, because we found our ocean monument. It is far, far away from where we want to be, but it is here. It exists, and the good thing, it looks like it's fairly close to the surface. All right. We'll see you next time. Bye for now.